Uh, my name is Robin Whitaker. I teach in the anthropology department at Memorial. I am also president of Memorial University of Newfoundland Faculty Association, and I am a known troublemaker. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> There are things that we are allowed to talk about his, in our history and things that tend not to get talked about. And the erasure of colonialism in the past and the present is an enormous thing in this province. I think that it obviously it continues to reverberate into the present and it, it continues to be an active issue for us in this province. And yet that is not a term that gets talked about. Newfoundland la nationalism is built on silence is about Labrador very much and that I think is um, a major issue for us. There's the, you know, the price of um, inclusion is exclusion of certain uncomfortable topics, um, maybe people, maybe certain realities, aspects of our history that are not easily renderable in uh, comfortable terms. Um, but then there's also the way in which people can be met with silence, right? And so um, one of the ways I think that silence becomes a vehicle of power here is that if you say certain things, no one responds. And that becomes very, very powerful in terms of setting the terms of debate. What do we need to do? Um, we need to insist on being able to speak. Uh, we need to listen to people. Um, I think we need to confront those aspects of our history that have been met with silence. This whole country, nationalism, not just in Newfoundland, but in Canada, is built on silence. It's built on the fiction that this was an empty place, you know, conceptually had to be cleared away um, in order to talk about Canada as a nation of immigrants. What does that mean? <laughs> Think about that statement, Canada is a nation of immigrants. What kinds of silences are entailed in that phrase?